morning, Bloomertown. It's a beautiful day to be 60 to 78 years young. Here's another gold moldy. Your phone charge is on. Your phone charge is on. Have a house. Lovely. Your phone torch is on. <laughs> Careful, Seymour. Watch out for the generation gap. I wonder how they're going over there. Yeah, bloody Gen Zs. Just remember, we're the ones that invented your precious World Wide Web. Seymour! Oh. Oh, classic boomers, making the gap bigger. They'd understand if they just listened to us. Yeah, season one was better. Hey, do you think all this screen time is adversely affecting our social skills? Well, it could be worse. It could be in our early 30s. Hey, millennials are still cool, right? Oh. Morning. So not slay. Are we saying slay now? Slay. 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 I just feel like no one pays attention to Gen X. We've got so much to s I don't care what they do, just not in my backyard. Hey, hey, in my backyard! This is their fault! Don't look at us, we're literally perfect. Typical young people, everyone gets a trophy. We were kids, you bought us the trophy! Stop gaslighting us! That's not what that means! Hands up! Cancel! Is that lamb? Lamb. You know, when I was a kid, we'd have lamb egg. Lamb barbecue? Lit. <laughs> well, at least we can agree on something. The generation gap! It's closing! The lamb's getting closer. I'm addicted to my phone as well! Takeaway coffees could be hotter. It's okay you spent 368 billion on submarines. Yeah, it was an impulse buy. Being a young person in Australia must be difficult. Being an old person must be pretty tricky too. Probably. I'm sorry. It's a barbecue for the ages. Who's that? Oh, it's John Howard. Oh. Who's that? Good to have the country back together. We weren't ever that far apart, sweetheart.